He was once public enemy number one. He created this image of Robin Hood. A notorious gangster is back in the headlines. John Dillinger was the anti-hero of the Great Depression, pulling off dozens of bank heists, even jailbreaks before fi police finally cornered and killed him outside of a theater in Chicago. Johnny Depp played him in Public Enemies. When Dillinger died, conspiracy theories circled about whether he was even dead. Well, now his family is moving forward with plans to exhume his body. And new at five, his family says that they do have evidence showing that the corpse that many believe is him is not. We'll let you know what they find. Well, that story got us thinking about the infamous Wild West outlaw, Jesse James. And tonight, we're digging into the KCTV5 vault to bring you the moment that his remains were exhumed just about 20 miles away in Kearney. This video is from 1994. James's family wanted his remains to get tested through DNA evidence. Well, even though it was widely accepted that another gang member, Bob Ford, killed him to collect the bounty. But some were convinced that James had faked his own death. Well, DNA tests show that it was indeed him buried in Kearney. For more from the KCTV5 Vault, you can head to our website or Facebook page and search Vault.